Hello everyone, it's VCL here and in this video I'll be showing you how to fix different DV errors like 6065, 6071, 6068 and 6058 for the game Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So all the solutions I'll be showing to you in this video are not my original solution and these solutions are posted by different users on different forums of this game. First thing that you have to do before performing any of the workarounds mentioned on the forum, first you have to clean boot your PC because clean booting your PC refreshes your PC and closes all the unwanted processes running in the background. So if you don't know how to clean boot your PC, I have made a separate quick guide of 2 minutes 45 seconds on how to do so. You can access that video by clicking a link in the description of this video. I have entered the link of this video in the description of this video. So you can access that video by going there. So once you have clean booted your PC, then proceed to the next steps. So I went through different forums of this problem, for example Reddit. I went to community.callofduty.com and I also want to act, went to Activision support. So here I will be showing you all the different solutions posted by different users and I'm sure that any one of these solutions will surely work for you. So let's get started. So first of all, so what was working for most of the users who posted their solution on Reddit was as mentioned by this user, I turned my graphics all super low but I changed my resolutions and made sure it was full screen borderless and it seems to be fine now going to try a match and then update you guys. So all you have to do is just turn your graphics low, change your resolution and make sure that you are using full screen borderless. And once you do so, most probably your problem will be fixed. I know that with low graphics your game won't look good, but it's only for the meantime a patch is released. Once a patch is released, this problem will be fixed and if you want to enjoy the gameplay till then, just change the settings to low. And many other users have mentioned that it worked for them for example, guys I fixed it by lowering settings under graphics, lower it below your normal graphics, work for me at least, good luck. And many other users also posted the same. For example, turn down your graphics settings such as shadows, particle lighting etc. This worked for you, this user. This user also mentioned, turn down graphics settings worked for me and others on this thread. Big players are shadows, textures and particles. So that's it for reddit forum. Now I'll be showing you what worked for different users on call of duty forum. So here, a guy mentioned that, so I just got in contact with an ambassador and pretty much their response is, yep, that is a problem and the only fix right now is to update to DirectX 12. So if you are not updated to DirectX 12, update it now and your problem will be surely fixed. Now let's come to this workaround and I found this to be the most informative one. So the only fix that worked for me is disabling ray tracing in the game settings. After that, I was able to play for over an hour without crashes. I hope they will fix this issue soon cause ray tracing is gorgeous. So this is you can try disabling your ray tracing and it might work for you too. Now let's come to this page and this one is also informative but some of the users are not even having these options in their PC so this might not work for all and this is the last workaround. So alrighty lads I found a fix for me. To be fair, I tried so many things, so it could be a combination of some of them, but the one that got it working for me was disabling the display scaling. So to dis disable display scaling, locate your game exe file, right click on select properties, 